Welcome back to Love and Junk. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we're trying a couple more chips from our friends at Aldi. Oh yeah, these are Japanese inspired. That's ponzu ginger and wasabi flavored. means do you um i don't know what it means i know it's like a flavoring and i think it's kind of citrusy okay good that's what i was wondering does that mean something spicy i don't know about that i know about that i i'm hoping that that's not going to be blow your head off <laughs> wasabi yeah spicy because sometimes it is that way so yeah. i'm predicting that laura is going to prefer the ponzu ginger <laughs> i'm a fan of ginger so yeah, are you ginger's good. uh yeah the wasabi if you've never had wasabi it's very similar to horseradish mm -hmm. you know it has that kind of nasally heat but the consistency is kind of like guacamole yeah <laughs> And I think if you've had wasabi in the States, most of the wasabi in the States is just kind of colored horseradish anyways, because right. it's very kind of a rare thing. Yeah. You know? Yeah. So let's end with that one. Yeah, I, I think, think so too. All right. So we're excited to give a new chip from Aldi a try. As always, we should say hello and welcome to our channel. Hi. If you're new, please stop what you're doing and subscribe to our channel. Make sure you hit the little bell because we put out a new video every single day. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out. All right, sniff test. Now trying something like this, you know, mm. is what I think we would like to have the small bags for, but. Yeah, so many of you ask about that. If this came in a small bag, we would buy it in a small bag. In yeah. fact, most new flavor chips we would buy in a small bag. But they weren't available. Here this smells the, like chicken. Here in the States, this is about a normal size bag, though. <laughs> this smells like chicken to me. It does kind of smell like chicken. Like, I don't know if it smells like chicken chicken or like a marinade that I would associate yeah. of putting on chicken. But that's, I'm getting chicken yeah. vibes. I'm definitely smelling those citrusy notes. Me too. Cheers. Cheers. Here we go. Mmm. Whoa. I like this one. Wow. I like this one too. Woo. That is savory as heck, isn't it? Yeah, I'm so glad we tried this. <laughs> That's good. Let's be real. Um, we have busy lives. We try to fit in YouTube when we can. Uh, we've had these for a while. Yeah. We've had these for a couple of weeks now, maybe more than a couple of weeks, that we just thought, when we get around to it, when we get around to it, I kick us now. Yeah, they are delicious. Don't making kick this me. Weight. Kick me for making this weight. Uh, this is the kind of chip you crave. For yeah. real. This is the kind of thing that, you know, at the end when I say, should we run back and get more? Yes. Yeah, very good. Uh, salty. Uh, there mm -hmm. are citrusy flavors to it. And if you're sensitive to salt, it's uber salty. Yeah. But it's good. Mm-hmm. Which is probably why we like it. You know what? Very hard to describe. I can describe it. Okay, go. Sort of, sorry. She had to swallow first. It's almost like the seasoning packet from a ramen noodle pouch. Kind, kind of. like that, yeah. That kind of like chicken ramen, but with ginger and citrus notes thrown in. But the powder that's on it is kind of like that. Yeah. Woo, that's good. Delicious. That's, that's good. All right. Number two. Let's see. No, I don't want to. You can't make me. Have a little sniff test. Mm. <laughs> Where's the teeniest, tiniest little chip? It definitely has a green tint to it. Yeah, ready? Wavy too. Go. Wavy. That's wasabi. For sure. Woo! Wasabi taste. 
I like the flavor of it. Mmm. It's got a little heat. My tongue feels numb. <laughs> <laughs> numb tongue. I have numb tongue. Um, it's spicy. But I like it. Is this going to make sense? Probably not. <laughs> um, so, I love Cheetos. I do not like flaming hot Cheetos or things that are heat for the sake of heat. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. It's got to have some flavor in it. This is heat, but also really good flavor. I'm going to give it props. I don't love it. I don't want to buy it again. I don't certainly <laughs> want to eat more than probably this little bite. But though, I mean, I'll probably finish this chip, but the flavor is really good. It's not just mm -hmm. heat, you know, for like the novelty of it. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It's good. Mm hmm. Yeah, good. But if you had wasabi before, that's what the flavor is. Mm hmm. It is what it is. Mm hmm. For sure. That's good. All right, so we're going to Aldi tomorrow. We are. Let's say <laughs> we'll be at Aldi <laughs> one day this week. I'm sure. I'm sure. First, she needs a drink. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like the tips of my ears might be a little red. No, they're not that. It's not that Ooh. spicy. Yeah. But would you want to pick up either one of these again? Oh, I'd definitely get that one again. What about and, this, and this one? is good. I don't know. Like for a chip or a crisp, I'm usually not a fan of hot stuff. Don't you like the sp the, the flavor of good. it? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm not in love with this one, but if I could tolerate heat, I think that would be my spicy go-to chip for real. I like it better than we've had like flaming hot ruffles and like all kinds of different things going around. That is not, like I said, it's not just heat. That That's really good flavor. And you won't hear that from me a lot. I give that props. Yeah, maybe good on a sandwich with ah. something else. Not just a chip buddy or, no, not Cri chip. Cri Chris. Chris, whatever. Um, <coughs> but, um, yeah, with, like, meat and stuff, I think uh -huh. that would be really good. Roast beef. Ever since we started this whole thing with our viewers from the UK, we've said, I never look at chips this, or crisps the same way again. I always picture them on a sandwich. That is the mark of a good chip. Am I right? Yeah. How it's going to taste crisp. on a sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, it gets confusing around our house when we just start talking about things. Sorry. <laughs> um, so anyway, uh, how would you rank these? Um, I would definitely give these ones a nine. These, I think I'd give them seven and a half. Nine and eight. Mm. I Sorry, or you're welcome if you're into ASMR. The cat apparently found a something. bag. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Somebody needed some attention, apparently. Yeah, somebody was getting... He smelled the chips. <laughs> into some bags. So. so, you know how I am. Normally, the hot one would not get high marks for me. I ranked it high, higher than you yeah, did. Yeah, you did. Yeah. I really, really appreciate the flavors that that one has going on. Too spicy for me on the regular, but I enjoyed it. This one is the kind of thing, like I said, that you crave. Yeah, the next time we go to Aldi, I definitely want to see if they have more of this. Yeah, here's the thing with Aldi. You never know if they're going to have it again, if they're going to keep having it. So. I know. So, this is Journey to Japan. It says Ponzu Ginger Wavy Potato Chips. Are these cleans? Please? I'm trying to um, see. I can't, you know, most of the chips are cleansies. Yeah, it just says Journey to I can't really, read it. Yeah. You Props. don't know about the bandit. Or band. Brand. Brand. Props to whoever made these. Props to Ollie. Go get you some. If you're not following us on social media, please come find us. Yeah. Rookie is there. And so are all the other cool kids. We cool are cats. Cool cats and kittens. <laughs> we are most popular on Instagram. Or that's where we hang out the most. <laughs> yeah, that's where we That's where post. we spend the most time. Post most frequently. Uh, Hi, buddy. We also have a game channel, if you didn't know that. We've been talking about that a little bit more. And we're starting to post there more regularly as well. Love junk and games. Now, if you love Aldi, which we do. We do. Or Japanese crisps, which, I mean, now we do. Yeah. 
or us or, or rookie <laughs> or the video give this video a big thumbs up it really helps our channel when you do that that's all we have for today see you tomorrow that's it guys bye bye